how's it going everybody this is our first video that's not a live stream from the new village area as you can see from our large conglomeration of wooden pipes Skyra is on and getting our automation done I didn't want to start our new uh, our next live stream out with testing this so I figured I'd go ahead and record a little video to show you guys we are going to test the sluice make sure everything's running we already have it up to pressure because we forgot to input the water <laughs> and so now it should take off and start working which it is we do need to get uh, some chests over here i do believe we have some in storage uh random building stuff let's grab some chests we don't have the sluice automated yet for um pulling it out and yeah you're right um sky it definitely is only two so i was wrong this time you're right so you got any more of them pipes we can put in here at least one that won't get burnt under it to hold a little bit of sluice juice that way we can get at least a little bit more of this done to try to get the aluminum we need uh, this aluminum we're getting out of here will give us some to be able to make our cobalt brass in the morning for the buzz saw so we can get that done so I'm hoping to get at least nine of these out of here before he has to stop laying pipe because it's... Oh, you found more bronze pipe. Cool. I thought we were out of metal pipe. All right, so we definitely have what we need to make the cobalt brass. Everything's running well. I'll take you down here in the sewer and show you. By the way... Yoshi made us a manhole that looks a little more like a manhole. Go ahead and shut this off since it isn't needed anymore. But there's where our water is running up. All the boilers are hooked up. This is going to be our sluice output. We've actually run out of wood. We're going to have to go do a massive cutting. You can see that the pipe system has changed a lot down here. He's got them... I guess pretty much already ran. Um, actually, I think there's a bronze saw left in there. If not, we have more steel. We can make another saw. But these are... So he has um, ways of seeing where the intersection is. Because I had that question. So this is where the distilled is going to run under the water line and up. And he ended up hooking the dryer up back here. So we now have a tank for sluice juice, which is what he needs to get hooked up when we figure out a um, saw for him. And this is where the distilled water one is. He's got so much wooden pipe for distilled water that this thing's been running nonstop for, what, an hour at least? And we still aren't showing any progress on the fluid meter from the dryer to the tank. And so he'll probably start that back up. Uh, it was full stack of coal coke. Yeah, and that burns for quite a while. You want me to bring down another stack when I come down? Go get another saw made. So we should still have enough steel to do so. Yeah, we got steel right here. It's a good thing about the blacksmith being your kid. You can kind of get away with making stuff. There you go. One steel saw and a bronze saw that's still almost broke is ready for you to make more pipes uh, we also have the buzz saw pretty much done yeah it's in there um, he's got this is the water line that needs to be ran up here for the buzz saw 
Uh, we just got to run metal pipes here. So first thing in the morning, Junior's going to have to make a bunch of copper and bronze pipes to hook everything up. And we are down to the last of our copper right here. So we need to get the uh, sluice done as soon as possible so we can get the buzzsaw done as soon as possible. Well, the sluice is done. But we need to get the buzzsaw done as soon as possible so we can get the crusher done ASAP because we have a whole chuck of pyrite vein down there, which I'm probably going to go do a bit of mining tonight and get some of the regular copper out of there because that needs to be the first thing that's ran through here because we are hurting for copper. Unless somebody knows where there's another tetra vein in the sand. We've used all of it we have. If you know where there's another one, let's go get it after we get done recording because we definitely need it. Two more. Well, that works. We'll go get it as soon as we get done with this. So we were actually full on creosote. Um, we started making torches out of them. But crazy still getting us more wool to make more torches. I've made all of this and the tank is still completely full. So, well, it's a... Wait a minute. 432. We're actually a little bit below. And he's been sealing up a bunch of pipes. Um, but that's not really enough uh, room to do more. But we have but tons of cold coke in here so we've got enough to power stuff for a little while and if we need to oh you were talking about your advanced table sorry i put it in juniors all right so here's us some more wool so we can make some more torches use up some more creosote and with all of this coke that we have we should have plenty of dark ash so we can do a bunch of iron purifying junior will get to do that and we can uh, actually start having some iron around this place crazy still doesn't have her kitchen supplies for Pam's harvest craft because we're hurting on iron and copper real bad that's what she needs to make them so hopefully tomorrow in the stream crazy will have her stuff to make her tools and we will have most of these machines up and running so that is your video update for what's going on tonight hope you don't mind that it's so short but we're not really doing a whole lot in videos for this area we're doing most of it on streams uh, if you want to join the stream, we're here every morning, 10 a.m. Usually, sometimes I might be at 10.30, but usually it's starting at 10 o'clock, running for two to three hours, Eastern Standard Time. So, see you there, or watch another update next time we have one. Later.